Hello, Fickbit Gaming here, we are back in Slime Rancher. Today we are going to do the third special area, the labs. So let's just talk with the guy. Hello Beatrix, thank you for taking the time to assist me with this project. It is a matter of great importance that is something. My apologies, I am in the middle of some uh, delicate work and I sometimes forget I am wearing my immersion field. Now then, the matter at hand. I need some assistance testing an in development simulated reality of far far range. I am attempting to use the simulation to predict slime behaviors and evolution. Alternatively, you could call it a slimulation. Huh. I had calculated a response of at least a mild chuckle from that wordplay. But no matter, let's proceed. My slimulation is an infinitely complex project that could be the key to understanding slimes on a level we've never dreamed. However, it is sadly riddled with bugs. Well, not bugs per se. Technically speaking, they are a flawed simulation of a slime that has discovered a way to replicate. Fascinating in its own right, but very much disrupting my studies. I call these entities glitch slimes, and I need you to help me collect them for study. Here's how it works. Enter the slimulation and begin exploring. Your goal is to collect glitch slimes, which will automatically be turned into bug reports up max sitting to the slimulation. However, this is easier said than done. Glitch slimes have exhibited a curious behavior on conforming to their surroundings, perhaps to write detection from me, it is not clear. Refocusing this discourse, glitch slimes will look like normal slimes and objects within the environment, though something is usually off about them. To reel them, walk up, whack up the suspicious slimes and use my handy debug spray on suspicious objects in the environment. As a reward for your thoughts, I'll grant you Manifold Cubes, a special multiple purpose rest source I invented which you can use for fabricating unique gadgets from the blueprints you find in the slimulation. And as we conclude each major phase of our work, I also grant you additional rewards, but more on those later. later. My research has, dis has determined that adding mystery to reward mechanisms incentivizes participants to try harder. Oh, and this is really not terribly important and I'm certain it's quite nearly under control, but... Due to the data corruption and the slimulation, they will reach a point where tar-like entities will begin appearing and taking over the slimulation, and you should really get out right away. When this occurs, I'll be sure to signal a beacon on the first available location where you can safely log out. Just follow the exit markers when you see them, they'll lead you to the exit portal. Okay, great, glad you have no questions at all. Especially about that la last bit. So let's get to work. I have no idea what the first thing is supposed to be. It looks strange and I need a hundred buck reports. Well, why not try it? Ah, cool effect, the slimulation. Where can I get the buck spray? Wait a moment. You're not supposed to be here. I need to find me some bug spray. There it is, I believe. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, naturally. That just had to happen. They knew I were onto them, I'm pretty sure about that. Suspicious. Anything suspicious over here. I could honestly just... Oh. Hello, glitch slime. Why is it ward off? 
Uh, probably to... You returned. Hello, come in, come in. They are not easy to suck up. But you can get a bunch of them easily. Hello? Just let me suck. Yeah, that sounds bad, but it is what I do. Was that always there? Yes. Okay. Let's move on. Okay, the teleporters are just floating in the middle of the air or what? Or is that not a teleporter? Curious. Come all in. And don't jump into the water. That's not going to help me. I want to see that island. Can I get there? I can. Why is there a pot in the simulation? Field kit. A perfect setup for projects on a range with the rain and the bugs and maybe just stay inside. Ah, that sounds like visuals. Purely visual. Okay, another pot. Supply drop. Interesting. I didn't even remember there being a place like this. I will have to check if the real world also has some pots around here. Would be nice and easy to get. Okay. It's not hard to find them. This island would be very good to farm them, but... They also like to die. A little bit too much. Hey guys! Okay, debugging. Okay, seems it's not worth it to try and debug them. Okay, that doesn't seem to be enough to activate the entrance yet. Cool. Any resources? Resources. That were changed around here. Now it's activated. Now I don't care to get out. Okay, a bubble pot. How nice. Wait a moment. They don't eat me, they eat my glitches. What the hell? Come here. Unless you want to get eaten by Tar. Yeah, I should leave and just enter again. Better stay safe and keep my back reports on me. So it seems I need to do it three times to get the necessary points. Hmm. Do I get the blueprints from this machine too? Would be quite a possibility, but let's 
just going back. After all, this time I know better what to do. I love this glitchy look. What do you have? Fruit slime bait. Cool. So... My free range? Uh, why are you all here? Did they not despawn? That's not fake. I can't believe it's not fake. That's fake. Ah, that's big. Good to know. They're not as easy to suck up as I'd like. Are there more? Are they making fun of me? Wait, can they transform into different types of slimes? Because there sure are quite a bunch of yellow ones. Uh, honey and pink ones. Yellow. My brain is yellow today too. But it seems the fakes shudder a little bit if you use the backpack. There, eat the fruit. Yeah, I don't think I will find anything fake here easily. Ah, okay. Derpy looking slimes are fakes. Good to know. Any other derp slimes around? I'd love to get to know you. That's a real slime. Why did you attack me? Are you kidding me? Even Lucky Derps exist. Did they get all of the Derps? I can't tell. Getting out of the water is the pain. Hey. I know you. I know your type. You ditto. Are you a Ditto? Yes, you are. You don't get to explode. Sure, Dittos can use explosion if the form they copy uses explosion, but... I say no. Not today. Interesting how the things combine here. What happens if I pick a normal slime with me when I leave? That shouldn't go well, should it? You are there. No derping around. Ok, 
Okay, those guys are around. And the exit activated. I'd like a few more slimes, but... Doesn't seem that's in the card. How the hell did that happen? No, no, no. Not taking my slime. Didn't it say the nearest one activates? The sure as hell isn't the nearest one. Are you kidding me? This is almost making my way back to the start. This is making my way back to the start. So many dub slimes. And I've ignored all of them at the start. Or they weren't there. Who knows? Okay, Chickadoo just disappeared. That's fine. But I need to do one more round. To see the new thing we can unlock. 24 slimes. That shouldn't be that hard. And now to remember, just suck up all the slimes around. And it is this place again at the start. And all of the tars are back. Let me get my glitch. Who said you can escape me? Come on, get up. Should probably just keep sucking all the time. Don't ever stop. Danger zone might be helpful. Or not. Okay, they seem to die on their own sometimes. Hello? What did I say? Leave my glitches alone. They're my glitches. And game, don't you dare put me back to that spot to leave. If you do, I'll be very annoyed. And I mean very annoyed. There's a perfect fine entrance right here. And this is a nice area. Look at it. How did I not realize that my energy was zil? Oh well, I'm just gonna leave and go back to that spot. But really, how did I miss that? Well, at least I know how to be careful this time. Where are 
about you. Anybody else left? Would be nice if they didn't disappear after getting sucked in or melt. Might be the better word. Yeah, pretty sure there was nothing on that corner in reality. But damn, that's a nice number already. No, I just need to not die. I'd love an upgrade that increases the speed of my sucking. Just make it faster for them to fly into my backpack. And this time I'm making sure I have the energy needed. What kind of area is back here? Or maybe there might be even some breakable. Yep, there is one. And probably on top of there too. Or maybe not. And this. Just looked in the wrong direction. Come on, give me energy. There's a purple here, and it's a shortcut to another area. Once you're this high up, you can basically go wherever you want in the game. If you're careful. You know what? I might just wait until the glitches appear. Would probably be my safest bet. Still, does the simulation just and well just have the mountain, forest and starting area? Don't think I've seen the temple area. What I'll go there. To that technological mushroom tree, whatever. Yeah, nothing special. Great. Oh, uh, nothing we find up here. Oh. How did I suddenly slip? I am a moron. Give me another spawn. You start to annoy me. Just as I said, just suck everything. Seems to work out very fine. Still, and this is going to be annoying. Since you can't just immediately finish, that means I will have to wait until I get a door. Even with the just suck everything strategy, 
It seems that you ca could make a hundred of the slimes easily. Just fill up your backpack with stuff and start sucking. Okay. While the gold slime can't be fed, probably it's still pretty valuable. With a bunch of glitches. Just if they could stay. New glitches just dropped. I already have many more than I needed. But I'll go on a journey. Where did that thing disappear to? Yes, hello, dangerous slime. Remember that that one can be what is fake. Already at 50. Only problem is Lagos. As you can see. Unless they are fake. Then Lagos are very welcome. I have to say I like the simulation. Slime relation. It's nice to look at. And not hard to do. Like at all. Just need to invest some time 